गुरुर् साक्षात पर ब्रह्म तस्म श्री गुरुवे नमः तुमेव माता च पिता तमेव तमेव बंधु सखात्मेव तमेव विद्या द्रविण तमेव सर्व मम देवदेव जे उत्पत्ति स्थिति लय करे वेदोस्तुति उच्चरे जे नारोम सुछिद्र मा अणुसमा ब्रह्मांड कोटि फरे माया काड रवि शशि सुरगणो आज्ञान लोपे क्षण एवाक्षर धाम ना अधिपति श्री स्वामी नारायण जनियमृतवाणी तो वहि रहि साक्षात महिमा रूपे जनी ब्राह्मी स्थिति अहो लीन करे सुभव्य अक्षर पदे शरणागत निज अल्प जीव सहुना श्रेयार्थ तत्पर रहे काका स्नेह सिंधु दिव्य विभुने हय्यो तो वंदन करे सजानंद स्वामी महाराज नी जय 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 आज के आनंद की जय 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 सदगुरुदेव की जय 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 गुरुहरि काका जी महाराज गुरुहरि पप्पा जी महाराज बंधु बेलड़ी शताब्दी पर्व महोत्सव नी जय 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 प्रकट ब्रह्म स्वरूप हरि प्रसाद स्वामी महाराज नी जय 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 प्रकट ब्रह्म स्वरूप जस भाई साहेब जी नी जय 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 प्रकट ब्रह्म स्वरूप अक्षर विहारी स्वामी महाराज नी जय 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 प्रकट ब्रह्म स्वरूप मुकुंद जीवन स्वामी गुरु जी महाराज नी जय 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 सर्वे गुणातीत स्वरूपो नी जय 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 टुडे Pankaj Bhai started out with Guru Brahma and then before he started this Jai, he paused. Pankaj Bhai Ajay, first Guru Brahma said and then Jai said, first 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 Jai said, Pankaj Bhai, repeat it, or not, 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 or not. He was, I was thinking that is he going to skip that or what, you know. But then he really made the real interesting, you know, meaning that we all had a pizza today. Most of us, you know, some of you may not have uh, taken yet or you may have come with food, you know. So before I go to that one, Vandan Bhai said that he is not going to come and have prasad tomorrow. Any particular reason? <laughs> but what is the reason? <laughs> huh? No reason? Okay, it must be then Shital, huh? <laughs> when the husband says no reason, you know what the reason is, right? <laughs> So, Sheetal, what is the menu for tomorrow? We all can come. Kale shubana vana se Sheetal men. Oh, nathi khabar? Toh toh beda tu bhi nirdos. Par kale, koi program na hoi toh avjo na tiyo jam jo beda. That would make more sense, right? Yeah. ना कोई जगह में कोई जवान हुए नहीं हुए तो जुदी बात है। पर 
પણ સવારે બ્રેકફાસ્ટ ના લેતા હો તો બી કંઈ વાંધો નહીં આપણે આવીને બેસીશું દેર આર સમ પીપલ હુ ડોન્ટ ઈટ બ્રેકફાસ્ટ ઓર હુ સ્કીપ લંચ જસ્ટ ટુ બી ઓન ડાયટ પ્લાન એનો સો વી અન્ડરસ્ટેન્ડ એનો સો વી વિલ જસ્ટ બી યુ નો પ્રેક્ટિકલ ધોઝ હુ વોન્ટ્સ વોટ એવર દે કેન ટેક એન્ડ ઇન મંદિર વી હેવ અધર વેરાયટીઝ ઓલ્સો યુ નો પણ આવજો બધા જમજો અમારા ભાવનાબેન અમારા સવિતાબેન દે હેવ એ બિગ હાર્ટ ટુ સ્પોન્સર ધીસ ટ્વેલ અવર ધૂન સો વેન આઈ વોઝ ટોકિંગ ટુ ધેમ આઈ સેટ દેટ આઈ આઈ નો વન પર્સન હુ ડુ ધૂન ફોર વિથ મી ફોર અબાઉટ ફોર અવર્સ કેન યુ રેઝ યોર હેન્ડ નો આઈ વોઝ ટેકિંગ અબાઉટ કૃષ્ણ on saturday he joins with me you know and he does not get tired you know so i enjoy so tomorrow is your day krishna you know triple bonus 4 hours versus 12 hours right <laughs> yeah so before i skip you know so i was talking about our pankaj bhai you know that when he told you know that everybody has eaten pizza and i saw everybody really roaring up you know and that continued even when i repeated also you know our youngsters i heard more youngsters voice when i was saying jay eh? so thank you all of you youngsters huh? and another thing that i was told at the last hour you know that our great indira ben and gansham bai's daughter shruti ben needed more time to prepare the vachanamrut for next week so maybe i want to find out that also that what happened you did not get full support from your parents beta oh avid nahi etle ઓ આજે ગેમ છે એટલે સોરી ઓકે ઓકે બટ સી એને પ્રિપેર કરેલું છે ને ઓકે પણ એને પ્રિપેર કરી શકે છું સી ઇઝ વર્કિંગ ઓન દેટ હે તો તારે થોડું કહેવાનું ભલે આપણે જવાય નહીં પણ હું તને શીખવાડું બેસ એને તૈયાર કરાવવાનું થોડુંક થોડુંક છોકરાઓ શીખશે દે વિલ લર્ન ઇફ વી ગીવ લિટલ પુશ ઓલ્સો હે this vachanamruti is very special scripture you know bhagwan swami narayan himself has talked in there you know so even if we show some interest out of our capacity interest then we will get more benefits out of that we should make a habit you know to read at least some portion of vachanamruti maybe one page or one vachanamruti more is better you know but if we read then it will catch on to us and then it would become really part of our daily life you know like pankaj bhai had said one time you know that we should read five shlokas from shiksha patri we should read five to 10 vatos from swamini vato we should read something from vachanamrut and some other books you know so shiksha uh, that patra sanjeevani or you know divine touch or those so those things we have to prepare ourselves to find the time apne jo khare khare dil mein ichha ho ek mar atlu vachvu che to vachvanu man thai tv jovanu ke natural thai gyu che button dabavanu you know we press the button and watch tv and we waste many hours you know on that but i was talking with our amy today you know that because of this phones and other things the new generation is not sitting in front of tv now the tv shows are dying you know and they will have to do something otherwise they will be out of market also and something else will come you know so it is okay you know that we spend time on the phone or tv you know but portion of our day we should put some spiritual food on our plate and we should read something 
I read a lot, you know, during whole day, I find time, you know, and you would think that, yeah, I'm retired, so I have time, right? <laughs> no, I was not retired and I was still finding time, you know. If we put the priority, then it would happen, you know, you would do that. You know. Yeah. From the morning I wake up and even in the bathroom, I don't waste my time, you know. I start with Vachanamrut, I start with Swami Nivato and others, you know. So, we can do two, three things at a time, you know. Apre ek vastu kariye in a time na hoy, to eki sathe be vastu karvi. Eki sathe tron vastu karvi, you know. Savare, at the morning I do exercise. When I'm doing exercise, I use my two hands when I'm using my leg exercise. I use my two hands and go on WhatsApp, you know. I get over 200, 300 messages every day. And I still answer all of them, you know. Because I think that they have time to send to me, then I should not be lazy, you know. I should not be not paying attention, you know. If they have time to talk to me in whatever way, then I should find a time to communicate with them, you know. That is at least my thinking, you know. I, I would like to, you know, be friends with them, be honest with them and be also courteous with them, you know. So, I think if you find the way to do multiple activities, then you will gain, you know, you will have time, you know. And there are some activities, you know, that if there is a video on my WhatsApp, now I cannot have the video and listen to the, you know, morning sabha. No, I will not do that. Because then my attention will be not fully taken, you know. But some other things we can do it together, you know. So Amnar Bhagavan and in his time there were other devotees, they had memory of hundred items at a time, you know. If somebody says one hundred different topics, they would remember one, two, three, all the way to hundred, you know. They were called Shata Avadhani. Shata means 100. Shata Avadhani. Avadhani means they have attention to 100 items at a time. So we are not saying 100, but at least we can say 2-3 items. But that way it will give you more time, you know, to focus on some of these satsang topics. So my again request is, you know, that find time to read some nice scriptures, some nice topics, which can give you the spiritual food, you know, and that would help a lot. So, today, I was thinking about going on the Vasnamrut that we talked last Friday. Apreje, last Vasnamrut machelu, e puru natu thayu, because of the time. So, since our Smriti Ben is going to do it next week, next Friday. Would that be okay? Okay, so then we would just have her continue. Which which number she was going to talk? Hey? Okay, she is going to select one, right? Okay. So I will read Gadra first 18. And since the Ram Naomi, just few days ago, the birthday of Swaminarayan Bhagavan, and Lord Ram, the BAPS enhanced their BAPS Vachnamrut app site in a very nice way. I don't know how many of you are using that BAPS Vachnamrut app. Can you raise your hands? Oh, quite a few. Okay. So, how, how many of you have gone through the new one now? The new app? Okay. But it has automatically updated on mine. I don't know if that has updated on yours or not, but if it is not, right, but if it is not, you can go back on the store and update that. Now, in that, they have four different languages, mainly Gujarati, but they have helped. So, first language is Gujarati, 
And if you need any help, you know, you can call me or you can let me know, you know, I can help you. I'm not going to walk through here, you know, now. But the first one is Gujarati. <clears throat> then the next language is Gujlish, which is Gujarati and English together. So that it is the English alphabets, but in a Gujarati speech. So, if you cram that thing, then you will be a good Gujarati orator here also, speaking in Gujlish. Hmm? Well, our Kiran Ben is trying, you know. She was trying this bhajan today, and she was flopping, you know, a little bit. But that's okay, you know. That's how we progress, you know. Huh? But the way if we understand, then it would be easy. Because what Kiran Ben was saying, you know, that if we add A at the end of the word, then she is extending it, A. But it is not A, it is A. If we have double A, then it is A. So that is what we have set up in our, you know, uh, last 15, 20 years of time, you know, and our books and other things, that methodology, you know. And it is very easy and standard, you know. So, they have very similar to that, you know. But then there is another one which calls United Nations style, you know. It is in Gujlish again, but it is little different alphabets, you know. Little, little different, you know, signs on the top and etc., you know. But they are both very similar, you know. But they have found maybe, you know, people who are accustomed to one style rather than the other, you know. So then there is a real English version of Vajnamurut. And that was already before also, you know, that in BAPS app, that English Vajnamurut was there also, you know. So now they have enhanced. The other thing they have done is that in Gujarati, they have bold letters and they have orange letters or uh, orange sentences and paragraphs. So those, they have more description. If you touch on that, it opens up another window and it gives you more description. But it is in Gujarati only. I think it is in Gujlish also. But same is, is Gujarati meaning. So at least you will make an effort to learn Gujarati maybe this way, you know. And if there is anything we can help you, we are here also, you know. Now, what I think is that the translation in English is done with a lot of efforts, you know. But still, the real intent, the deep tone is only understood when we read Gujarati. Because when Swaminar Bhagavan uses certain words, certain context, you know, it only makes sense, you know, when you know the Gujarati part, you know. But I'm not saying that you will all be master of that. But when I read Gujarati, I really enjoy, you know. But at the same time, I want to be practical, you know, and I'm talking in English. That is why I'm talking now, you know, in English, you know. So it is both together, you know, and you will really have good time. Also, they have more topics also. And even I read some Gujarati and there were some still missing typo. So they say that we can text them, we can email them, you know, and they will correct. So if somebody goes through the English part and finds something, maybe you can send that by email to them also. So the next version they can improve, you know. So this is happening better and better, you know. So today I will read this one in Gujarati and try to talk in English also. Huh? So Vishay Khandannu Havelinu. Samvat Adar So Chhantirna Maksharvadi Chhatne Divase Ratri Pashli Pohar Baki Hati Tiyare Swami Shri Sajananji Maharaj Shri Gadra Madhye Dada Khachanna Darbarmo Athamne Barne Odani Osariye Agar Phariyamo Dholiyao Par Viraja Hata Ane Sarva Svet Vastra Dharan Karya Hata So the word here says pahor. Pahor is like three hours. So before the night was ended, three hours before that, so our Disha Ben 
had said last time that normally 7 o'clock the sun rises. So, four hours before that, which is like uh, three hours before that, which is four o'clock in the morning, Swaminar Bhagwan came to the place where there was a common place, you know, in, in this Dada Khachar Darbar, you know. So now when I click on that orange part, you know, so it tells the English date instead of Gujarati Tithi, you know. So Maksharvadi Chhat is translated as 8 December 1819. So that is the only part they have English version <laughs> on the comments. Others are in Gujarati. Maybe they may have some other English, but I have not found yet. So, this is the description, you know, that Swaminarayan Bhagavan was sitting in Dada Khachar's Darbar. Now, then, Pachi Paramhaun Sada Satsangi Ne Tedavya. Then, Swaminarayan Bhagavan was sitting with himself and his you know, Murji Brahmachari, his, you know, uh, support helper, you know, and maybe few devotees, you know, or sadhus. So, Swaminar Bhagavan wanted to talk to more. So, he told to wake them up at four o'clock in the morning. Normally, sadhus, they get up three o'clock in the morning. But there are some who get tired, they have done some work at night, so they were sleeping. So Swaminar Bhagavan went and told them to get up and come for an important discussion. So Pachi Paramahams Tatha Satsangi Ne Tedavya. He invited the elevated saints, Paramahams, and the devotees. Ane Ghanivar Sudito Pote Vichari Raya. Then Swaminar Bhagavan had a special style. When he wants to give a special discourse, he would just meditate with his eyes closed, not talk, and let everybody focus, and let everybody eradicate their current condition, whether they were sleepy, or whether they were thinking of something else, or they had some other business. So, to drop all those, and look at God, and then focus at God, and then Swaminarayan Bhagavan will say, this was his unique style. Certain Vachnamruts he has like this. Ghanivar Sudhi Pote Vichari Raya. Ane Pachi Bolya. Then he said, Ek Vat Kau Te Sambro. I am telling you one talk and please listen. M. Kaina Sriji Maharaj Bolya. जे मारा मन में तो एम थाई छे जे आ बात न कहूं पण तमे अमारा छो माटे जानिए छिए जे कहिए ज समनार भगवान सेज इन माय माइंड आई फील लाइक नॉट डिस्कसिंग दिस टॉपिक बिकॉज़ दैट इरिटेट्स भगवान हिमसेल्फ दैट मेक्स हिम अनहैप्पी बट ही सेज बिकॉज़ यू आर माइन एंड बिकॉज़ जस्ट लाइक पेरेंट्स look at the misbehavior of a child and then they would not th think that what should I tell my child, you know. Nanu chokru ho hai, yana kai bhul kari ho hai, yana maa baap, yani samay joya kare, yana shu ke uma re ho hai, yana vare vare kai u chata paan, yani yaj bhul kare shi. Itle, thoda chup re, paan pachi, yana vat kare. Same way, Bhagwan is saying, I feel like not talking. But you are mine. And I want to make you elevated. I want to make you gunatit. So, then I think that I should tell you. But in this message, Bhagwan is toning down a lot from what really he wanted to tell. He is mellowing down and then telling. So this talk is after a soft language approach, you know, that Bhagavan is talking, you know. 
અને આ વાત છે તેને સમજીને તે જ પ્રમાણે વર્તે તે જ મુક્ત થાય છે નવ ભગવાન ઇઝ ટેલિંગ ધી અચીવમેન્ટ અટેનમેન્ટ દેટ વોટ આઈ એમ ગોઈંગ ટુ ટોક ટુ યુ ઇફ સમબડી વુડ અન્ડરસ્ટેન્ડ ઇટ એન્ડ લીવ દેટ વે ધેન વીલ લિબરેટ અધરવાઇઝ માયા ઇઝ વેરી ટ્રિકી માયા ઇઝ વેરી પાવરફુલ માયા વીલ પુલ યોર લેગ્સ સો બી એટેન્ટિવ એન્ડ લિસન ભગવાન કહે છે તે વિના તો ચાર વેદ છ શાસ્ત્ર અઢાર પુરાણ અને ભારત આદિક ઇતિહાસ તેણે ભણવે કરીને તથા તેના અર્થને જાણવે કરીને અથવા તેને શ્રવણે કરીને પણ મુક્ત થાય નહીં સો ભગવાન ઇઝ સેઇંગ દેટ ધેર મે બી પીપલ હુ વુડ હેવ રેડ ઓલ ધીઝ નાઇસ સ્ક્રિપ્ચર્સ ફોર વેદાસ સિક્સ દર્શન શાસ્ત્ર એઇટીન પુરાણ્સ બાય વ્યાસ ભગવાન મહાભારત એ બિગ બુક પાર્ટ ઓફ ધેટ ઇઝ ગીતા એન્ડ ઇતિહાસ લાઈક રામાયણ એન્ડ અધર્સ નો સો સમબડી મે હેવ રેડ દેટ સમબડી મે હેવ સ્ટડીડ દેટ એન્ડ સમબડી મે હેવ અન્ડરસ્ટુડ ધી મિનિંગ ઓફ ધી વર્ડ્સ દેટ એન્ડ સમબડી મે હેવ લિસન ટુ દેટ બટ ઇવન દે કુડ નોટ બિકમ લિબરેટેડ સોલ્સ બિકોઝ ધી ઇન્ગ્રેડિયન્ટ ઇઝ નોટ જસ્ટ લિસનિંગ it is the next two three stages after listening listening then reciting within pehlu shravan aave sambhadiye shravan kevai pachi enu manan karvu pade manan etle ke emonu mare ketlu ketlu kachu ch je me sambhadu emathi mare ketlu oju paaku karvanu ch and when we are doing reciting our mind plays the game આપણે જ્યારે મનન કરીએ ને ત્યારે માઇન્ડ બી આપણી સાથે રમત રમે કે આ તો હવે ઠીક છે એનો નહીં કરીએ તો એ ચાલશે આટલું તો બધું અઘરું છે ના થાય એટસેટેરા એનો એ આજે ચંદ્રકાંત ભાઈને આઈ વેર જસ્ટ કમિંગ ઓન ધી ઇન ધી કાર એન્ડ આઈ વોઝ રીડિંગ સમ ટોપિક યુનો વિચ વોઝ લિટલ બીટ હાર્ડ યુ નો થિંગ ટુ ફોલો યુનો સો ચંદ્રકાંત ભાઈ રિમાઇન્ડેડ મી દેટ પપ્પા જી હેઝ સેડ દેટ યુ આર ઇન ધી સત્સંગ યુ ડોન્ટ હેવ ટુ ડુ એનીથિંગ નાવ વી વિલ ટેક કેર ઓફ યુ સો યુ વોઝ સેઇંગ દેટ આઈ ડોન્ટ હેવ ટુ ડુ એનીથિંગ યુ નો યુ હેઝ સેડ દેટ આઈ વિલ ટેક કેર ઓફ યુ નો એન્ડ આઈ સેડ યા યુ નો બટ અવર ગ્રેડ્સ વિલ બી નોટ હંડ્રેડ પર્સન્ટ યુ નો ઇટ વિલ બી બેરલી થર્ટી ફાઈવ પર્સન્ટ પાસ યુ નો ડુ વી વોન્ટ દેટ ઓર ડુ વી વોન્ટ ટુ ગો ટુ ધી નાઇન્ટીઝ એન્ડ હંડ્રેડ યુ નો રાઇટ so for that we have to make an effort no apne bhi effort karvo pade agru che eno it is hard no eh pan are bhai agru natu to america ke vich na avya how did we come america if it was not hard no eh chandrakant bhai pharmacist right right with his credentials you know he came to america so if you did not go to pharmacy school you would not have made it right you had the hard work you know and then he worked in india also right and he worked in one of the uh, he was given the offer in one of the uh, town in kathiawad where swamnar bhagwan had visited goraji na goraji and whenever i read swamini vato there is one vat about gunadita and swami about goraji so when i read he reminds you know that i was given the offer to work there but the point is you know that we have to make an effort also you know apne andar thi jo taiyari nahi kariye ne to apni gaadi dheere thi jase slow it the car will slow down our speed will slow down so we have to make effort from within ke mara thi bhale ek hi sathe 100 daglo nahi chalatu par aaj ek daglu to agar chalvu ch i cannot go 100 steps today but at least i want to go one step if he, if i go one step in the right direction then that is my last step that was that is what kaka ji used to say you know. so apne evo effort kariye andar thi if we make a sincere effort then the other 
help will come. And being a sadhak at the young age is a big challenge, you know. And I really command, you know, those who have taken this sadhak roadway, you know, our Pindu Bhai, our Vijay Bhai, our Bhavik Bhai, and our NG Ben, and others, you know. So, it is not an easy roadway, you know. But they have taken that fight, and for them, lot of Gunatit saints are, you know, blessings them, you know. They are supporting them, you know. And our Sahib Dada and Swamiji and others, you know, they are very happy about their action, you know, their steps. Because in India, it is a different story. You are in the group of hundred of such sadhaks and sadhus. So, you have a nice push. But here you are only handful. And still you are doing it, you know. Still you are fighting, you know. So, that is an extra credit, you know. That is why Swamiji is very happy in this country, you know. Really, in America, in the 90s, our Chicago group was the first group who started the sadhak program, I think. None in whole America had, in our Swaminarayan group, had started a sadhak who were raised and born in this country and decided to become sadhak, you know. Right. So we have our heads off on them, you know. Some of them, you know, honestly could not continue, you know, and we understand, you know, that's fine also, you know. So, it is more power to them, you know, that they have done this, you know. And if you are also Swami Narayan Bhagavan, you should talk about this, that we should talk about this. So, the point is, you know, that young age is a challenging time, but if you be strong, and if you maintain that, then you will be a hero. You will be very advanced in your spiritual endeavor. You know. And today we see the whole BAPS worldwide you know, is flourishing because those youngsters who were collegians, that Kakaji guided them, and by the blessings of Yogiji Maharaj, they became the saints and they have done this extraordinary, tremendous work in the BAPS group and in other groups, you know, our groups also, you know. So, again, all of you who are still college bound, you want to continue this zeal and this effort. It will be hard there, you know, I know. It would be a challenge there, you know, because there are a lot of attractions. Lot of smiling friends, they will come and say, hey, let's go to the party. Let's have beer or let's have deer, you know. But you have to decide, you know, that my friends is my books. My books are my friends, you know. And I tell sometimes, you know, in India to those who want to get more grades, that I said that make your book, your friends. And I say, if you write down on the math book, on top of the math book, one of your good friend's name, you know, eh? Mr. or Mrs. or Miss so and so. And when you write down a good name, now your math book becomes your friend, you know. So when you open that book, that book is helping you. History and all others, you know, you write down different names, you know, on, on that book, on top of the page of the book, you know. And you try, you know, it will give you a psychological boost, you know, that, okay, I want to be with my friend, you know. But this is a big challenge, you know. And you remember that those who are top grade students, they get invitation in top grade companies at a very high salaries also. So, you are not going to be lost, you know. If you don't want to work for somebody, fine. Remember Kakaji and start your own business and you will be successful also, you know. It is either way, you know. But you would have a confidence within yourself that you will be able to make it. But again I am telling you that if you don't follow certain rules, 
then you will fall down. No matter how elevated you are, you will have problems. You will have your mind playing games with you and you will have breaks for your speed, you know. You don't want that, you know. You want this thing that is Swamdhyana Bhagavan is saying to master that to be successful. So now Bhagavan is saying that even after reading all these scriptures and all these things, there is no guarantee that you will not fall down. Here Bhagavan is saying, how you will not fall down? What is the technique that you will not fall down? So Pachi Bhagavan says, Te shravane karine pan mukta thai nai. Te vat kahiye te sombro. Je bahar to gamme titli upadhi hoi. Pan teno jo manma sankalp na hoi, to teno amare khar kharo nai. Samdhar Bhagavan is first starting out with the outside disturbance and inside mental control. That no matter how much attraction, how much disturbance we have outside, but in the inside, if we are firm and if we are decided, then Samdhar Bhagavan says, I have no problem. And I can tell my own example that I came in 1966, at that time, no phone, no communication, very little phone, you know, no cell phone, nothing, no communication, you know. And our family was raised with vegetarian food, you know, vegetarian meal. I never touched even egg in my life, you know, in India, you know. I don't remember even touching egg here, you know, but I may have touched egg, you know, of the birds that maybe have in trouble or fallen down that I put it back maybe in India. But <laughs> that's all, you know. <laughs> so when I first got into the plane, Air India flight, from Bombay to London, a Parsi fellow sat next to me. And I had a, you know, my jacket, coat, and a tie borrowed from my elder brother, you know. And nice pant and shirt, and I was, you know, very alert, you know, because this is first time I was riding in the plane, you know, not knowing what happens in the flight, you know. So a Parsi businessman was sitting next to me going to London. So he is, he started discussion with me, you know, that in Parsi language, you know, ka <laughs> jawano. In other words, you know, said, son, where are you going? <laughs> that is how this, their language is very sweet, you know. Parsi people, they, they are very sweet. You know, there is one Parsi fellow in our satsang. Huh? Anybody knows? Parsi or Sindhi, right? Our Hindi there is no Jamai, no? Dudhani Sahib. Is that Parsi or Sindhi? Sindhi, ne? But they have also very sweet language, you know. They have sweet language also, you know. But anyhow, he asked me, you know, that where are you going? So I said, I'm going to America. So then he figured out that I must be going for study, you know. He says, are you going for studies? I said, yeah. So then he started conversation that America is very cold. I said, that's why I have selected Atlanta, <laughs> down south. <laughs> because I looked in the map. And I had five, six invitation or offer from the northern part of USA. But I didn't want to go, you know. I said, <laughs> Atlanta is better. And Atlanta was equal to north of Kashmir, you know, in India. And when I was in school, they used to say that in Kashmir, in the winter months, people put the fireplace in front of their body, you know. They hang it and they keep their hands cold, you know, uh, warm, you know, with the fireplace. So that I remember, you know, that in Kashmir they do that. I said, I don't want to do any more than that, you know, by going north, you know. <laughs> so I told him that I am going in Atlanta. He said, but Atlanta is, he says, also cold, you know. It is very cold there. 
So his point was that you'll have to drink liquor, you'll have to eat meat, you'll have to eat eggs. So he started telling me, you know, and I said, no, I have decided I'm not going to take liquor and I'm not going to eat anything, you know. Then he says that, but you will not survive, you know. You will die. I said, no. And you look today, you know, I'm healthy. <laughs> All these years, you know, I have maintained my diet and my, you know, health. Anyhow, the plane took off. And the air hostess comes with servings. And the serving was chicken. But chicken looked like bhajia. You know, we have like bhajia here, you know. So I thought that this is bhajia. <laughs> but it was smelling, you know, a little bit strong smell. And I said, well, maybe, you know, it's different flavor maybe, you know, but it may be, you know, bhajia. But that Parsi man saw that. <laughs> and he said that, Mr. Patel, this is meat item, you don't eat. I said, I don't know what is this. <laughs> and I had not started eating, you know. My style is, you know, that if something is foreign to me, I pause, just like Swami Bhagwan paused, you know, here. <laughs> I paused, you know, and in the meantime, that person, Swamnar Bhagavan, speaks through him. And he tells me that, you know, don't eat this. This is not for you. Then he called the air hostess. And he said that this man is vegetarian. This man is vegetarian. And make sure that next flight also he gets vegetarian meal. So he made my roadway, you know. But... When I went, you know, to other aeroplane, now I learned, you know, that I would ask, right? That, okay, what is this inside? This is a small example, but what I'm saying is that there is so much disturbance outside, you know. But if you have made up your mind, then nothing would disturb you. Nothing would shake you up, you know. जो आपने अंदर से नकी करी हो होए तो प्रॉब्लम ना आवे। In all these years, I have many friends, you know. They have been eating meat, they have been taking liquor, you know. But I have made up my mind, you know, that not for me. I am not for that, and I have survived, you know. But we have to have our mind balanced and strong. We have to have our Understanding and conviction strong, you know. Hmm? Few days ago, I was telling our Pintu bhai, you know, that you are vegan, you know. He is vegan, you know. And he has some, you know, uh, congestions problem, you know. Uh, and if he does not eat food properly, you know, he would have problem, you know. But still, he is, you know, maintaining as a vegan status, you know. So I told him that you are better than me because I am not vegan, you know, and you are vegan, you know. So I said, where did you get this inspiration to become vegan, you know? And the answer was very surprising to me. Anybody knows? Rachna. Huh? Rachna. Yes, Rachna. Rachna is vegan. I did not know that, even though, you know, I go to her place sometimes and other, but I never thought that she is vegan, you know. And it is out of compassion, you know, you know, that we don't want to be hurting animals and we don't want to be taking away animal products, you know, which is very healthy and it's healthy for our body also. More and more people are now convinced that if you go on vegetable and vegetarian food, you will be more healthier than anything else, you know. So, it is good also, you know. It, it's just the matter of creating a habit uh, or our lifestyle, you know. But even Rachna, she has picked up this thing, you know, that she wants to be a vegan, you know. And normally, vegan people, they are deficient in B12 and other vitamins, you know. But there are other supplements, you know, that you can take to make up that part also, you know. But anyhow, here Bhagwan is saying, 
કે બહાર તો ગમે તેટલી ઉપાધિ હોય પણ તેનો જો મનમાં સંકલ્પ ન હોય તો તેનો અમારે ખરખરો નહીં સો વોટ એવર ડિસ્ટર્બન્સ ઇઝ આઉટસાઈડ એન્ડ સ્વામિનારાયણ ભગવાન ટ્રાવેલ ઓલ ઓવર ઇન્ડિયા વેરી હેન્ડસમ પાવરફુલ બોય હુ ડુ યુ થિંક વુડ નોટ વોન્ટ ધેર ડોટર ટુ ગેટ મેરીડ વિથ હિમ કિંગ્સ ઓફર્ડ ધી પ્રિસ્ટ્સ મેરીડ પ્રિસ્ટ ઓફર્ડ અધર લીડર્સ ઓફર્ડ નો હે બટ સ્વામિનારાયણ ભગવાન સેઝ નો 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 દેટ્સ હિઝ ઇનર કન્વિક્શન એન્ડ હી હેડ લેફ્ટ હિઝ હોમ બીકોઝ ઓફ દેટ હિઝ એલ્ડર બ્રધર રામ પ્રતાપભાઈ હેડ ટોલ્ડ હિમ એટ ધી એજ ઓફ ટ્વેલ્વ દેટ વી હેવ સમ પીપલ આઉટ ઓફ ટાઉન હેઝ હેવ કમ ટુ ઓફર ધેર ડોટર ટુ યુ ટુ સ્વામિનારાયણ ભગવાન ટુ ઘનશ્યામ એન્ડ ઘનશ્યામ સેઝ ટાઈમ હેઝ કમ ટુ ગો આઈ એમ નોટ ઇન્ટરેસ્ટેડ ઇન આઈ હેવ કમ ફોર ડિફરન્ટ પર્પઝ my purpose is to elevate rather than being bonded and get into more bigger snowball effect you know so swamir bhagwan never had any interest anywhere anywhere in the whole travel you know but here bhagwan is saying that અને અંતરમાં જો રંચ જેટલો પદાર્થનો ગાઢ થાય તો તેનો ત્યાગ કરીએ ત્યારે નિરાશ થાય એવો અમારો સ્વભાવ છે એન્ડ માઇન્ડ પ્લેસ ધી ગેમ ઇફ યુ લાઈક ટી આઈસ્ક્રીમ ફર્સ્ટ સ્પૂન ઓફ આઈસ્ક્રીમ હાવ મેની ઓફ યુ હેવ થોટ ઓન ધી સેકન્ડ સ્પૂન દેટ ધી સેકન્ડ સ્પૂન ઇઝ ગોઈંગ ટુ બી ટેસ્ટિંગ સેમ એઝ ધી ફર્સ્ટ વન બટ ઇટ વિલ એડ ફેટ ટુ મી ઇટ વિલ મેક મી ફેટર હાવ મેની હેવ યુ થોટ on the second spoon nobody yeah that is mind apne ice cream no pehlo chamcho mina masi moda ma mukiye pachi bijo chamcho khati vakat evo vichar aave ke baki nu badhu charbi sharir ma charbi ubhi karvano che he jarbi thai ne pan apne bijo chamcho band kar de ચાલુ જ રાખીએ છે તમે જ નહીં ખાતા હો તમારા દીકરાને બી આજે મેં કહ્યું મેં કહ્યું બેટા તું આવ્યો છે હે તો પહેલો જે ચેક આવે સેવામાં આપજે તો કે હું તો બધો ચેક બધું સેવા કરવામાં જ આવ્યો છું કે સ્લો હા તો મેં કહું સાધુ આવ્યો છે મારો એ રાઈટ સરસ સરસ કંઈ બી પ્રોબ્લેમ હોય તો તારે ફોન કરો આમને બેટા હં જો કે સીએમ અંકલ ને પદમાંડી બી ત્યાં છે એ બી તમને હેલ્પ કરશે એનો હે પણ કંઈ સત્સંગની બી વાત સાંભળવી હોય જાણવી હોય તો બી ફોન કરવો હે અને સવારે ટાઈમ હોય ને તો આઠ વાગે અમે સત્સંગ કરીએ તે વખતે બીજો ટાઈમ મળે હે પદ્માવતી અને સીએમ બે હાથ જોડીને પગે લાગીને પૂજે હે કે ભાઈ કરવું તો આ પાડે કરવાનું હે એ બી સાંભળતા હોય છે સારું સારું સરસ તારી મમ્મીનું આ ડ્રીમ હતું હે કે મારો દીકરો અહીંયા આવે મને બી ફોન કર્યો હતો પણ મને આ સીએમનો તો વિચાર જ નહોતો આવે મને કેમ થયું ભાઈ મેં કહું હું તો કંઈ ધંધો કરતો નથી એટલે હું એને કેવી રીતનો તમારા દીકરાને નોકરીમાં રાખી શકું એનો હે પણ અહીં આવો અહીં લાવો પછી કંઈક ભગવાન ગોઠવશે પણ તારા મામીને મગજ બહુ જોરદાર કામ કરતો છે એવું બધું ખોરી લાવે આખી ચંદ્રલોક સુધીનું બી ખોરી લાવે હલો હામેથી આવી ગયો ભગવાન સરસ ગોઠવે ના સારું સારું સરસ સરસ સો ભગવાન ઇઝ સેઈંગ કે 
અંતરમાં જો રંચ જેટલો પદાર્થનો ગાઢ થાય ભગવાન કહે છે કે ઇવન એ સ્મોલ માઇન્યુટ અમાઉન્ટ ઓફ ડિઝાયર કે મારે બીજી ચમચી આઈસ્ક્રીમ ખાવો છે સહેજ રંચ જેટલો જો ગાઢ થાય તો તેનો ત્યાગ કરીએ ત્યારે નિરાધ થાય એવો અમારો સ્વભાવ છે ત્યાગ કરીએ ત્યારે નિરાધ થાય ભગવાનનો કેટલો બધો સ્ટ્રોંગ ઓપિનિયન છે એનો કે આ તો એક આઈસ્ક્રીમ તો એક્ઝામ્પલ આપ્યો વાત એનો પણ કોઈ બી વસ્તુ એનો હે વી અધર દેન ગોડ નથિંગ શુડ રિમેન ઇન અવર પ્રાયોરિટી એનો હે ભગવાન વગર ને ભગવાનના સાધુ વગર બીજી કોઈ પ્રાયોરિટી ના રહે તો આ વચનામૃત પાકું થાય હે અઘરું છે પણ ભાઈ કરવા જેવું છે એ બી છે એનો માટે અમે હૃદયમાં વિચાર કર્યો સો ધેન ભગવાન ટેકિંગ હિઝ ઓન એક્ઝામ્પલ ધેન હી થોટ કે ભગવાનના ભક્તના હૃદયમાં વિક્ષેપ થાય છે તેનું શું કારણ છે જો અમને વિક્ષેપ થતો નથી તો અમારા ભક્તને પણ થવો ના જોઈએ પણ થાય છે તેનું શું કારણ છે કઈ વીક લિંક છે કયા પ્રોબ્લેમ છે શું એને પજવે છે એટલે કે છે કે ભગવાનના ભક્તના હૃદયમાં વિક્ષેપ થાય છે તેનું શું કારણ છે પછી મન બુદ્ધિ ચિત્ત અહંકાર સામું જોયું સ્વામિનારાયણ ભગવાન સ્ટાર્ટ્સ ફ્રોમ ધી ઇનર કોર હે એમ જે કોઈ રાજા હોય કંઈ કંઈ પ્રોબ્લેમ આવે તો પહેલો કોની ઉપર ફોકસ કરે એના નજીકના માણસ ઉપર કરે ને હે સેમ વે વિધિન ધી સોલ ધીસ સોલ્જર્સ આર ધી ક્લોઝર ટુ ધી સોલ મન હિઝ માઇન્ડ બુદ્ધિ intellect chit our focus ahankar our ego so these are the four departments of our inner self there are many others but these are main four you know to kaise ki pachi man buddhi chit ahankar samu joyu tyo to ye antah karan par udveg nu karan nahi so they are very honest to me bhagwan says my mind is not playing game with me maru man che e મારું નોકર છે મારું કયું સાંભળે છે એટલે એ ઉદ્વેગનું કારણ દેટ ઇઝ નોટ ધી કોઝ ઓફ પ્રોબ્લેમ એનો હે અંતઃકરણ પણ ઉદ્વેગનું કારણ નથી અંતઃકરણમાં તો ભગવાનના સ્વરૂપના નિશ્ચયનું બળ અથવા આત્મજ્ઞાનનું બળ તેને યોગે કરીને અંતઃકરણને ગાફલ તારે છે સો ભગવાન ઇઝ નાવ સેઇંગ દેટ વી હેવ ફાઉન્ડ ગોડ વી હેવ ફાઉન્ડ ધી માસ્ટર કી ધેન વી હેવ ફર્મ કન્વિક્શન ઓફ અવર સોલ અવર આત્મા સો ધી અંતઃકરણ ધી ઇનર આર્મી ઇઝ લિટલ બીટ લેઝી દેટ નથિંગ ઇઝ ગોઈંગ ટુ હેપન યુ નો વી આર વેલ પ્રોટેક્ટેડ યુ નો હે સો દેટ ઇઝ ધી ઓનલી પ્રોબ્લેમ ઓફ ધી ઇનર ઇનર સેલ્ફ that it has over confidence and that is the only fault in the inner body ane andar ma gafalta rahe che je bhagwan madya che te have kai karvu rahyu chandrakant bhai ha ayu papa ji sutra saras aapyu suno but that is for those jyoti ben tara ben they have already crossed they are already there you know. આપણે જ્યોતિબેન તારાબેન થવું પછી એ વાત બરોબર છે કે ભાઈ હવે હવે કંઈ કરવાનું નથી પણ ભગવાન તો અહીં બી ના પાડે છે તો એનો એ ગોડી સહિંગનો એ બી ગાફલતા ના જોઈએ દેટ કાઇન્ડ ઓફ લેઝીનેસ ઇઝ સ્ટીલ નોટ ગુડ નો એ અંતઃકરણ કંઈક ગાફલતા રહે છે જે ભગવાન મળ્યા છે તે હવે કાંઈ કરવું રહ્યું નથી ગોડ ઇઝ વિથ હસ સો દેર ઇઝ નથિંગ વી હેવ ટુ વરી અબાઉટ જસ્ટ ખાઈ પીને મજા કરો બી એક ગાડી અને તાજમહાલ હોટેલ રાઈટ એવું ગાફલપણું રહે છે એટલો જ અંતઃકરણનો વાંક છે દેટ ઇઝ ધી ઓનલી ડ્રોબેક ઓર સ્મોલ ફોલ્ટ ઓફ અવર ઇનર સેલ્ફ દેટ ઇટ ઇઝ ઓવર કોન્ફિડન્સ અને જાજો વાંક તો પંચ જ્ઞાન ઇન્દ્રિયોનો છે નાવ there are five talent or uh, knowledge senses 
and five slave senses, you know. There are ten senses in our body. But the slave senses are not also controller. The knowledge senses, the five of them, the eyes, the ear, the nose, the tongue, the skin. Those, those are the five, you know. So, they are the cause of this problem. So, Pach Jnanendriya no Vakshya Kese. Anetyani Vigat Kaiye Chie. And then, Samdhan Bhagavan is explaining all the detailed things on this thing. The time is getting to 9.44, 9.45. So, uh, maybe we want to again pause or let us say, if anybody has any question that maybe we talk, you know, only on this topic that we talked or any topic, you know, then I would like to have most of you come tomorrow for trial hour dun. I was going to say something about on dun, you know, which I missed, you know, that dun is a very powerful tool, you know, very powerful instrument that can change our inner crude nature, you know. We will not know and it would happen. But the only condition is that we don't want to do dhun like a tape recorder or like a parrot or like a little baby, you know. We want to do dhun with the magnanimity, with the mahima. When I sing that Om Swami Narayan, and there it comes, you know, Swami Narayan Mahamantra no Mahima Aparam Parche. Ane Brahmarup Thavaiche. When, when I come to that point, naturally I go back to the time where Swami Narayan Bhagavan gave this mantra first time to the devotees and the saints. Phanini Mo, in the Phanini town, when Swaminar Bhagavan gave that mantra, Jare Perlo mantra Swaminar Bhagavan apyo, un e vakhat na time mo I, I reach there, you know, I, I, I always go there at that time. Ke only 20 years young boy, no microphone, no speaker, no nothing, you know. And thousands of devotees eh, addressing and everybody listening. The last one also listens, you know. What kind of magic, what kind of power he must have used. And he gave this mantra, Swami Narayan. A 20-year-old boy has come up with a powerful mantra, most powerful mantra, that never has been on this earth before, you know. And then he exercised the power of that, you know. The devotees went into the samadhi by just chanting one time, you know. That, is, that was the benefit in his presence. You know. <laughs> so we chant Swami Swami We are not falling down by saying Swami Swami We don't go to samadhi, but there is a Jnan Samadhi, you know. We are developing into a different level, you know. So my suggestion is that try to come, you know, put some things aside and try to come and you will benefit by doing this dun, you know. And then the worst case scenario, if you cannot come, wherever you are, on phone, give up every other activities and focus on the magnanimity of the mantra and then chant, you know. Just like if somebody gives you candy in one hand and hundred dollars bill in the other hand, you will select America. Candy or hundred dollars bill? Banker, right? You are a banker. Yeah. So, moment we see two things, you know, we have clear picture. How much worth is candy and how much worth is hundred dollars bill? Moment we stand... Swami Narayan, we should have a clear picture, you know, that how much is the magnanimity of the mantra and Gunatitanan Swami and Swami Narayan Bhagavan, I am remembering, you know, how much power he has, you know, how much 
control he has, you know. And our America has experienced a lot in last several years, right, America? Whenever she calls me, she says, I want to do Dhun. As if she knows that Dhun is magic power, you know. Dhun has some magic power, right? So, that is why I'm telling, you know, that this 12 hours opportunity don't come often. And we will not mind even if you doze during the Dhun. If you take a nap during the Dhun, if you go and eat, or if you use the other things, bathrooms and other things during the Dhun, it's all pardonable. Bhagwan will accept, you know. But if you can come, you will experience, you know. Because I saw only few hands were raised, you know. And that's why I'm saying, you know, that if you have time, at least come for half an hour. You can make it at least for half an hour, you know, right? But come, you know, then you will see a difference, you know. So that is our humble prayer. And we all thank you for coming today also. And thank you, Jyoti Beta, for nice pizza. And they had put many slices in my plate. The whole plate was filled up. And I said, today, riot on diet. Eh? I ate all the pieces, you know. First, I selected that some of the salad I will not eat, you know, and I will skip. But then I said, well, I'll, I'll finish up that also. So I had full plate. And then somebody came for more pieces, you know. I said, I'm done. I'm good. But anyhow, Saras Beta, Badda Saras Bhajan Kariye, and Jani Birthday Che, it was specially Aujoj Bhai. Tamare Savakalak Ni Dhun Thai Jai, you know. On birthday, we always want to do 75 minutes Dhun. Savakalak Ni Kaka Ji Keta, Evi Dhun. So, Badda Ne Khub Khub. Danyavad, Saras Saras. अने काले सरसानंद करिए हाँ, we'll enjoy tomorrow. सजानंद स्वामी महाराज नी, जय जय जय. Okay, anybody question? कोई ना कोई पूछूँ?